Hey YouTube, Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. This is the channel where we talk about sneakers, life, and tech. And for this episode, we're going to check out a new, as in newly opened, bagong bago pa, fresh na fresh, sneaker and toy store over at Quezon City. This is Feed Your Feet Manila X Toy Bunker. If you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please make sure that you do so because we are giving away a Supreme Body Bag sponsored by Shoe Freak PH now that we've hit 100k subs. All you have to do is to subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram, hit the notification bell, hit the link down below for the rest of the mechanics. And by the way, just for the heck of it, we're also throwing in an Acer 23-inch TV for the raffle. Go! Just because I'm so excited, I want to show you guys first what I bought from the store. And I'll probably do an unboxing of this at the end of this video. So as I mentioned, it's a toy and sneaker store. And I love toys, as you guys see at the back and some of the glass cabinets that I had at the back. I was finally able to buy this toy that I've been seeing for the longest time. This is the SH Figure Arts Broly. Broly is my favorite Dragon Ball character ever since I saw him in that movie before where he kicked the ass of Goku and Vegeta and everybody else. Woo! And it is such a fantastic timing because there is a new Broly movie coming soon. If you guys haven't seen the trailer yet and you are a Dragon Ball fan, you are missing out. I'll put the link down below to the to the trailer of the Broly movie, which will officially make him canon also part of the actual story of Dragon Ball. Yeah! This new store is called Feed Your Feet Manila and Toy Bunker. So it's basically a collab of two stores. It's the combination of sneakers and toys and collectibles. So they joined together to put up this store over at Quezon City. It's literally just along EDSA, right after Quezon Avenue to your right southbound. So after McDonald's, uh, there's like two more buildings and then you see it there. They have a giant sign that lights up. It says there, Feed Your Feet Manila X Toy Bunker. So all you have to do is walk inside and check out all that they have for sale. Now, as the name implies, it's really a mix of toys and sneakers. The moment you enter to your right, there are a bunch of collectible toys from Star Wars to Transformers. They have a kick-ass Optimus Prime with a Megatron there. They have a bunch of like anime toys from the slam dunk figures from you know, man, Sakuragi and everybody else from that particular uh, anime series. And yeah, it's a really fantastic store to be able to check out toys and collectibles. That's the right side. To the left side and to the far back, you have a bunch of sneakers that they have for sale. Of course, most of these sneakers are not for retail. What they, when I mean for that is they are on reseller prices. So they are slightly higher or higher than your typical retail prices. But if you missed out on them and you still want to buy, then you, at least you haven't lost your chance. You can pick up a pair over at this store. So let's go over the different sneakers that I found interesting over at Feed Your Feet Manila X Toy Bunker. First up, they have a wide range of Air Force One utilities in three different colors. They have one in white. This, by the way, is the Air Force One with the overbranding. I actually bought the black pair. And I did a review on that one. I'll try to put the link down below just in case I don't forget. I always forget putting the links down below. But anyway, <laughs> yeah, it's the overbranded Air Force One. They have it in white, they have it in black, and they have it in olive green. Now, the SRP for this one, usually it sells less than 5,000 pesos, but they are selling it for a little over 6,000 pesos. So if you missed your chance to cop one and you still really, really want to buy one, you can get it here at a little higher price. Next up, we have the Forrest Gump Cortez for men and women. Now, as with, uh, I think a lot of people here in the Philippines are really in love with this sneaker for some reason. So yeah, I think they're selling it for a little over 5,000 pesos. They have a bunch of sizes. Just check it out. And again, as the name implies, this was actually the pair of sneakers that was given to Forrest Gump in the movie Forrest Gump. Now, for those who are more into hype, we have the 4D Alpha Edge from Adidas. They are selling it for 25,000 pesos. You're probably thinking, hey, why is it so cheap? Well, it's not cheap. First and foremost, 25,000 is a lot of money. But it is lower than the usual price that is being sold because it is pre-loved. 
it is second hand so it's not like super super brand new dead stock but hey if you're not particular and you just want to wear one it's a pretty good price so you might want to check that out i forget the size though i'm not sure if it's size 9 or size 10 so I, I i'm sorry guys i cannot remember for the life of me what was the actual size apart from that they have a bunch of yeezys from the belugas to the blue tints prices ranging from 18,000 to 20,000 again the prices are a bit low because they are secondhand pre-loved they also have brand new fila disruptor 2s so if you are a fan of the fila brand if you are a fan of the fila disruptor silhouette fila disruptor 2 silhouette uh, they have it in multiple colors including the beige one it's like an all brown slash flesh color they have the all white colorway i think which is like one of the more popular ones for the ladies and they have the white with the gum sole that is also pretty interesting that you guys might want to check out the fila disruptor 2 is being sold for 5950 pesos so again it is higher than srp uh, but that's the game that that's being played uh, for reseller stores now apart from that they also have the kenny uh, cortez 4 this these are the house shoes which originally retailed for a little less than 5,000 pesos i was able to cop a pair over at commonwealth and i also did the review on that one really fantastic comfortable sneaker guys one of the best cortez uh, sneakers that i've ever saw in well in the sneaker career of mine and it's the only cortez that i actually own they are selling it though for a pretty penny they're selling it for over ten thousand pesos so approximately twice the price that it was sold when it dropped uh, over at commonwealth now if you are looking for the more staple pairs they have an ultra boost v2 multicolor again in brand uh, it is brand new this is the one in red and white also did the review on this one cop this one i think from soul academy if i'm not mistaken or adidas Oh uh, no, it was in Seoul Academy. This one they're selling for 11,950 pesos. And yeah, they also have like a bunch more sneakers. I won't go through every single one anymore. Oh, but they also have the Jordan one, not for resale. But I didn't bother anymore asking how much they're selling that one because usually reseller stores sell that anywhere from 35,000 to 40,000 pesos. So those were the interesting sneakers uh, that they had for sale. Apart from that, they had like the Dragon Ball pairs and a few more other ones that you might find interesting. I think if you are in the area of QC, uh, at least now you have another store to check. You have another store to visit. It's not just the few stores that are within the area. So you have another place to check out for legit high pairs of kicks. Uh, again, you will just have to pay the, pay the resale price for them if ever you cop from that store. Which leads me to my unboxing. I'm so excited. I didn't actually buy a sneaker anymore <laughs> when I was there. I think I reached a point where I bought most of the sneakers that I want and I'm very intentional now with the sneakers that I want to buy moving forward. And like before, anything I like, cool, let's get this, let's get this, let's get this. Then I amassed such a massive collection. Now I'm trying to let go as much as I can so I can focus the collection on what I really want. So again, that's a lesson for you guys who are aspiring to be sneakerheads. Just buy the ones that you really, really want. Don't get like swayed or tempted or distracted with all the releases that you think you want, but in actuality, you don't want them and you won't wear them and you can't wear them because you have so many and something better will come along the way that you actually like and prefer. So yeah, just buy the sneakers that you will wear, that you will really love, that you will wear out. Yeah, so yeah, I'm learning from my mistakes, guys. But anyway, let's do the unboxing. This is the Dragon Ball Z Figure Arts Broly. Now, I won't do it in the, the fancy B-roll anymore because I'm just so excited to be able to take this out of the box. Woo! So, let's see what's inside. So, you have like a stand, transparent plastic stand, so you can use if you want to make him stand up. Uh, what else is here? Uh, more stands, and then you have like a manual on how to be able to just pose him and stuff. So, yeah. I'm like a kid in a candy store. So, whoo! Damn. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Here you go, guy. Oh, it is heavy. So here you have it. This is Broly by Figure Arts. Now, the great thing about this brand of toys is that the points of articulation for the toy is like so many. So you can pose it in so many ways. You can change the arms. You can, I mean, if you have fun like playing or posing, this is the perfect brand for you because of the multiple, again, articulation points all over the body. So you can like come up with multiple poses with Broly if you wanna play with this particular toy. Now, apart from the actual figure itself, it does have like a set of hands, as you guys can see here, faces, and it does have also that familiar, those familiar 
Let me just get it out of here. Green ball. So the, the, the green balls. So this is actually the color of his energy blasts when he fires and attacks, uh, or, or when he at least fired and attacked back then. I'm not sure if this will still be the colorway, colorway. <laughs> it will still be the color of his energy blasts uh, once the new Broly movie comes out later this year or in the next few months. So again, I'm just so thrilled to be able to add Broly uh, to my toy wall. I will be probably putting him somewhere. Oops. I will be probably putting him somewhere there at the back. I'll probably replace the, the, they call that the Witch King back there. But yeah, I'm so stoked, so happy. I've, I've been looking for this for a while. I mean, I've been going up and down green hills. I, I can't find the, I can't find it. So being able to finally see it there, just standing on the shelf, whew. Insta cop, insta buy. So yeah, guys, that's it for this vlog. I hope you enjoyed. If you are in the area again in Quezon City, please do check out the store. The name of the store is Feed Your Feet Manila X uh, Toy Bunker, just along Edsa, beside uh, McDonald's Northbound. So check it out. If it, it, I think it's literally just the next building to the MRT stop. So it should be easy to find and go to if you don't have a car. So that's it for the review. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and follow me on Instagram, and hit the link down below so you can be part of our giveaway for the Supreme Body Bag as well as the Acer Monitor. Winners shall be drawn, will be drawn on Sunday. So that's like a week from now. I will be drawing it, and we will be announcing who the winners are for both items. So I hope you guys are having a great week. I hope you all had a great weekend. Peace. God bless. What's up? Boom!